people, uh, maybe just speak to the person next to you, just to think about um, Neve's situation. How do you feel about Neve's situation? What are the challenges she's faced? What, are, what possibilities were open to her? What choices did she take? And, and how did the piece make you feel? Just speak about that. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Okay, we'll take it back. Um, I sense that there's a lot of reactions in the room to the piece anyway. People are really yapping about it. People are itching to get out of the room. Could I get a feel from people, um, just some feedback on the piece? Um, first of all, on the on, 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 on Neil's position, how did it be? Let her not wear the gown again. <laughs> what? Sorry? Let her not wear that gown again. <laughs> Let her not wear the gown again. Which one? The one she ended up right. with? <laughs> the first one. <laughs> Anybody else said it? Yeah. Oh, she. Sorry, oh, she. I have to I, share. We'll come back to that. I want to count. Okay. Yes. Sorry, in all sincerity, um, it's it's unbelievable what the media is calling humans into. We tend to see all these adverts on anorexic people being portrayed as the best of the beauty that we can actually look at, and and the kind of craziness that has gone into it. I was having a discussion with the person beside me here about the, the family friend of ours who's a six year six year old daughter you know as fat as a boomstick and yet there was a day the mom was offering this girl kind of food and she's like no i'm dieting and this is a girl a six year old girl who is so thin as a finger you know and saying she's dieting and i mean if if it starts at that age i wonder what she'll be when she's a teenager and the trauma she has to go through just to look the way she looked. And then the, the, the fact that she even says she looks at I don't know what she used at the end of it. It doesn't even seem so feel real at all. Is there a need for her to torture herself before she gets to that level? What's the question you're asking? Does she need to torture herself to achieve what she eventually got to the end? Does Neve need to torture herself yeah, to, get, to, to get to where she needs to get to? I don't think so. I can see what happened. Uh, sorry, I don't want to. Um, I think at the moment when the system is with us in, at the beginning, I think she would have fought strongly there in terms of um, fighting her case of, I can be like this, I'm still sell what I have to sell, you know? I can be with them and they can sell the way they want to. Yeah, I think she could have yeah, fought it. Okay, so you didn't you, you didn't see that as necessary. You saw a moment where she was just like that. Uh, another person. Yeah, um, Neve said in eight months she had increased the company sales by twelve percent. Um, that's an amazing record in job history to have. Any sales company would be lucky to have you. You don't need to spend the time with Johnny Burton as a man of wielding alcoholic. Yes, uh, yourself. Um, I, I, I find these pieces about Neve. I think you know it's the messages that 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 the likes of Neve is receiving about what is acceptable and not accept, acceptable to get a job. I understand that in France at the moment, if you're unemployed and female. One of the things they suggest to you is that you have a makeover in order to become more employed. Yeah, I, I, I think that um, um, there's this um, guy called Bernays. He was the nephew of Sigmund Freud, and he is the father of advertising, as it were. And it's the sexualization and objectification of women in the sort of sexualization in the sale of a product. So it's dehumanizing women. So it was very well presented, the dehumanization of women. And um, the awareness that's needed around that to reclaim choice uh, in terms of, of women 
it, it is, is what Neo is struggling with. And um, it, it's quite upsetting, you know, it, it's very upsetting, you know. I mean, doing promos, you know, if you're a student, you could get a job doing promos for a club and you'd have to dress in a certain way. Very tempting, like, you know, but then you've got to, are you selling your, are you being forced to sell your body at this level and how many levels at which you are forced to sell your body? So it's all of that. But, uh, yeah, so it's, it's, it's powerful, like, you know, then the man really, you really want to sort of kill him, like. Shade, no, apparently, you know, for policy and crime. Well, well, it's just kind of, well, it's just kind of like, um, if you need help about a person, I don't think that's wrong with that. I think some people do need help with that. I don't think that's wrong with trying to look that your best. You know, I think there's a thin line between. I know we have a small emphasis on women looks clean and I don't think that's fine. Right, cool. So obviously, just to, to come back to the immediate situation, um, immediate situation, I think it's very telling. A lot of people are coming out with, uh, you know, from the first bit of feedback, people are talking about these much broader processes that affect people and their effect on young people um, and how embedded they are in, in the media and, and what people need to do to make a living and so on. Um, I, I think we come back now just to Neve's situation. There's been a lot of suggestions from people about where they thought that she could have resisted, where there might have been other possible channels that she could have pursued. And um, so what we're going to do is we're going to run the piece from the top again. Um, and as everybody's had a good rehearsal in this evening, uh, when you see a moment where you think you'd like to intervene and see how Neve can challenge that situation, Please um, yell stop and we'll go with it. So get a round of applause, please. Thank you, Thank you. Jesus, so do I, babe. I started here, you, you said 
Which is huge bargaining chip for her, this 12% thing. I think she, she underestimating how much beyond the how much worth she is. I don't, I don't think she's underestimating herself already. I think I'm going to have to do it. Yeah, she's going to Exactly. Isn't it amazing the way the world has changed in the last six months? I mean, one day I was driving a Porsche, next day I was just driving a BMW. I'd still throw that. Yeah. <laughs> so, 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 so. Well, it's not that I don't need you. I really appreciate having you around here. I don't. That's why I'm keeping you at the wage you're at. Brilliant. In this time of recession. Well, you look at everyone in the country, they're taking a 10% cut. Are you taking a 10% cut? No, no. I don't need 10%. Of course you won't. That's why I'm not paid. I'm not giving you one. Thanks very much. You're welcome. <laughs> Leave him over. No, no. But Jesus, we've got to crack on. I have to make money. You're still on the same way. You're obviously still functioning well as a company. I don't believe you. I want to. I just want to come find one thing that you need. I just want to tell you something. I promised myself a beautiful trip to the Caribbean on a boat this summer. I'm not going to be able to do it. It's just the way things are. You Really the girls out there shaking it and doing it. They're the girls making the money. They're my stars. It's an art form. Obviously, I'm used to working here. You've been approached by companies in this field at this time? I'm going to have some good advice by sales companies because obviously I have a great track record. And you know what? I think I could probably get a better deal here. I just know the ropes here. I'm about to go to college. I want to stay. But yeah, well, look, you look at I have, I have an excellent idea. I have an excellent idea. The girls will be in, start on promotions. They make a fortune. They're out there doing it. <laughs> but that's what this company is. It's a promotions company. Kieran and Oak Promotions, the land of the young ones. For God's sake. Yeah. And people who do look at my money at 12% sales. Look, I'm just saying, I don't want to say this. I oh no, I hope you're not going to say something hurt. Do I have to? Do I have to go all the time with the hassle of going to the company just to get a couple of percent? It's enough to give me that raise that you offered. Come on, Oshie, we've been working together long enough. No, I'm going to It's true, college. it's true. It's true. I will leave. I will leave. I'm not going no. out there. I don't want to lose you. Just I don't want to lose you, Neil. <laughs> 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 How did you feel about that? Yeah, um, Any progress? I have a problem. I have a problem with it. Okay. Uh, because while it protects me, the other women aren't protected. I would prefer if she'd intervened earlier when they were putting on the makeup and spoke to them and politicized them and they could all rebel together against her. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 